Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. So today you will be getting some kitchen cleaning motivation. You will also be getting some organization. I purchased some spice containers so that I can just um, organize my spices. I was honestly inspired by my pantry makeover and it just made me want to keep going with organization. Um, also, you'll be getting a grocery haul at the end of this video. If this is your first time stopping by my channel, hi, my name is Desnique. I'm a married mother of three and I do cleaning motivation, organization, a few transformations. And if you like that type of content, I would love for you to stick around and join my fam by hitting that subscribe button and hitting that bell so you'll be notified every single time I post a new video. Now, I would like to say that you're getting this video on Thursday and I know Thursdays are supposed to be my power hours, but if you guys will just bear with me while I'm trying to, you know, sort my channel out. So yes, you will be still getting videos on Thursdays and Sundays. I'm honestly um, considering doing Power Hour Thursdays every other Thursday and give you guys other content on the other two Thursdays. So comment down below if you um, guys will like that. So to get your Power Hour motivation, but not every week, maybe just twice a, a month. And then let me, I'll throw in some other type of content. And yes, I am using um, the Dawn Big Soap because for some reason my soap dispenser is just it's not working. It's clogged. Um, I'm just going to have to order a new um, soap pump because no matter what I've tried, it's just not working. So but anyway, let's get into this cleaning motivation and just check out how this barkeeper's friend, how it is going to transform the bottom of that pan. I've talked about this before. It just sells some bars keepers friend that stuff is amazing it literally is amazing so yeah all right guys let's get into this cleaning motivation
Okay, so now we're gonna get into organizing these spices. I got these containers off of Amazon and these labels as well. Um, if you're interested, the spice containers and the um, labels will be linked below. I opted to not go with glass because one, my kids actually do like cook certain things and on their own and I can just see it falling and breaking. So for my sanity and us not um, having a whole bunch of broken spice glasses containers, I decided to go with plastic.
Okay, and this is what these top ones look like. This has extra stuff. I do want to do something different because I do have a lot of extra cabinet spaces like that I'm not even using that like really have things that don't even need to be there type things um, that I need to address. So, um, yeah. So there's some more things that I need to obviously organize. But in due time. But, yeah. So it's looking like... Okay, so right here I'm just throwing in a clip of what the new refrigerator looks like. It's a side-by-side -side, and I had mentioned to you guys that I got this from a scratch and dent place so I literally got it half off and it was basically because there was adhesive stuck to it which honestly took me a long time. It took like an hour and 30 minutes to get it off so it was a lot of work. I had to use Goo Gone, um, Awesome, Dawn Soap. It was, it was some work <laughs> to get it off but it was all worth it. Um, this is the freezer side and I actually need to do better organization over here. That's what I'm telling you um, But I just haven't gotten to it yet now Honestly when my refrigerator is being brought in as you can see on the right hand side We'll see probably when I'm cleaning it because that'll be the next clip you can see it actually has a dent Now so I guess it's officially a scratch and dent you can see it a little bit to the right um, and that's because it was a struggle to get it in um, my husband and his brother realized they had to take the doors off but um in that process you know it got a dent so it's officially a scratch and dent um refrigerator but yeah i love the refrigerator i love the side by side um i love the features of the water filter and the ice love it and if i sound a little cracky right now because i picked up this video in the morning and it's like six something in the morning and this is my morning voice i'm sitting here drinking some coffee and finishing this video so if you are enjoying this video i would appreciate it if you would give it a big thumbs up
Okay, so right here I'm just showing you the final clip of how everything turned out. And if you pay attention, you can see that it is now dark. And I started this probably in the morning time. And that is just real life. Like, you can get it done, but sometimes I have to stop numerous times. I have three kids that are just doing learners. Um, I have to stop because just mom life. You know, kids want to go outside and play. Um, you know, just lots of things. Laundry. But I got it all done. And I just want to throw that real life moment in there to see, like, sometimes it can take me all day. And this was just a kitchen and some organization. So, um, what I do want to say is that the next clip will be a grocery haul. So I just want to, so I'm not going to talk anymore. So I just want to say thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you. And I will see you again on Sunday for another cleaning motivation. Until then, bye guys. But watch the grocery haul. Watch the grocery haul. Okay, now I'm going to start with the grocery haul. I just came back from Target. Um, I got some pepper stir fry for like fajitas when I put it in my eggs so it'll be easier instead of cutting it up. Some broccoli, three of these ground, I mean of these turkey bacons. The kids love these, they eat them up. Then I got some um, strawberry shortcake good humor bars. Gianna likes these a lot. I used to like these a lot as a kid as well. Some extra crispy. Um, fries for Ayana. Two of these P.F. Chang rices, fried rices, I like these a lot. Um, then I also got two of these French bread meat pizzas, Gianna likes these. And then I got some heavy whipping cream because I will be making Alfredo. And then I also got um, some cookie dough, sugar cookie dough, and then these confetti. Uh, Sugar, sugar cookie dough cookies for the kids and then I also got some taco shells for tacos some bread for french toast or just to eat um, bagels because my kids eat bagels up so quickly like this literally lasts a week 10 bagels lasts sometimes not even the whole week um, then I also got um, a cucumber because I've mentioned I love cucumbers in my salad um, some black beans, some cranberries, some mozzarella cheese, because I will be making homemade pizza this week, and baked ziti. Gianna loves these um, maple chocolate banana almond milk um, yogurts. They're really good. Some yellow rice, because I'm going to make it with something I'm going to make it with. I don't know if I'm going to do... Um, burritos or something something I'm gonna make with it this week some syrup some grits because if you saw my pantry maker or if you haven't I'm gonna put an iCart right here for you check it out um, the grits were very low in the container and then I got a red onion so when I can when I make guac and other things I like to use a red onion in it um, some bananas for smoothies then I got two of these vegetable egg rolls because I really love these. Like I'm going to actually eat this for lunch with one of these fried rices today. Um, then two of these Oreo Thins because Leonia, my oldest, she loves them. And it says family size, but this girl goes through those by herself. Um, Simply Lemonade with strawberry. Uh, Gianna likes these. I'm not a fan of lemonade. But, um, so she just really drinks those to herself. Cran mango, because I am a fan of this. <laughs> so, cran mango juice, three of those. The Fruity Pebbles. Um, coffee creamer, I told you guys about this. in iced coffee, which is right here. Super good. Hot coffee, not so much to me. Um, then, I got a green pepper. Well, green peppers. Um, because when I make, um, like a piece, which is like a Haitian spice, and I use it to season chicken and make rice um, and I just keep it in the refrigerator so I need like a whole green pepper for that. Uh, then I also got in the um, bullseye section the Target's dollar spot basically. They had this glow in the dark dark chalk and I was like why not get it for the kids. Got three because I got three girls. Uh, glitter sidewalk chalk. I was like oh that's cool. It has glitter. So I got three of those obviously so they don't have to fight over it. 
Then I saw this, which I thought was super cute. Like you could actually change it out. So I'm gonna be putting this in my um, kitchen. They have Hello Spring, Happy Easter, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, Happy Thanksgiving, and Hello Fall. Like I think that is awesome. So I will be using that. And um, then I got this Stoke um, coffee that I told you guys about. I still have one and a half left. But I'm pretty sure one and a half cannot get us through the week. So I got an extra one. And then I got some unsweetened almond milk. And then I got me a new, um, a new, what do you call it? A new doormat. Last week I got like a new underlayment for the uh, rug. And then I realized that my rug was kind of faded. So I was like, let me just get a new one. And then I also got this rug because I'm going to put this at the back door. I thought it was super cute, fits my style. I also had got this, and I didn't show you guys. I had got this rug right here. I got this from Target as well. Really like this in the kitchen. Um, it, one thing is, it, of course, it's like an off-white, but I have washed it already, and it does the stains come out right, right away. So um, you don't have to worry about it because, it's, it's, you know, it's... Um, you know that is white or off white that is you know like the stains are gonna mess it up no it washes well all the stains come out okay and this is what I got from BJ's I got some chicken breast thinly sliced um, chicken breast these work out great um, because I can give the kid the kids can make it themselves when they want something to eat some ground turkey I'm gonna cut this into three some lobster tails some um, Nestle Toll House ice cream bars for Ayana and myself. I like these too. Some um, tuna fish. I love tuna fish on a sandwich with some lettuce and some cucumbers. Um, it's great. Love it. Um, some of these uncured turkey franks. Um, Ayana likes these. We actually, well, yeah. Ayana likes them. Gianna will eat them if it's on the grill. I like it on the grill as well or fried. Some cupcakes, as you see, my kids already got to. Um, some basil leaves because you guys saw me doing the, um, the spice labels and I needed some basil. So I got some everything everything um, bagel seasoning because honestly um, I love avocado so I want to try it on it. It says it tastes good on other stuff as well and I have a label for it so I wanted to get it. Um, some egg whites because we eat lots and lots of egg whites. Um, corned beef hash we love that with our egg whites and um, some turkey sausage for a little breakfast idea for the kids and also some oatmeal raisin cookies so this is going to conclude the whole entire haul Taking time out, taking